In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change the theme of a website inside Google Sites. So right now, I'm using a particular uh, theme, and uh, a theme is kind of like a set of uh, graphics and colors uh, and fonts uh, that is used in in this uh, website. And but but you can change all that. You just need to click on More Actions and go to Manage Site. And at the bottom here, uh, underneath Site Appearance, it has Site Layout, uh, Colors and Fonts, and also Themes. When you click on Themes, there are some of these basic themes that you can choose. Uh, these are the more basic and, and plain ones. But you can also click on Browse More Themes. And these are the more exciting uh, themes that you can choose from. And uh, you can scroll down. Uh, there are many themes that you can choose from. And uh, you can continue to scroll down, and there are actually more at the bottom. Okay, so let's say I choose one of these themes. Uh, if I choose, uh, you know, look at this color, I, I kind of like that. I can just click on that. It, it has a little preview for me. If I can, uh, I want to select that. And after that, I click on. Uh, Okay, before I click on Save Changes, I can actually get a preview uh, right here. You see, it does not change my content. So all the text and graphics that I have previously created for my website, it will stay there. But it changes the layout and and what what it is called, you know, the theme. And um, now, if you you may say, okay, I, I really like this color, okay, but I I I am not doing soccer, okay, so I don't like the soccer ball there. Okay, can I change that? The answer, of course, is yes. You can easily change that. So, now, you notice after you have selected a theme, Google Sites automatically go into the uh, colors and fonts uh, area. So, you can edit the colors and fonts. Uh, you can click on that, and so you can change all the colors and fonts that, that, that you want to choose. Um, you, you can just try it out and see which one you like. When you go to, oh, uh, remember to, to click Save, okay? I should go Cancel and click on Save Changes. And now I want to go to Site Layout. When I go to Site Layout, it shows me that um, this is the basic layout of the site. It has a top area, it is called Header. It has the main page contents right here. And it also has the sidebar that is divided into several areas, and uh, you're familiar with the navigation, and that you can have several navigation areas. Um, but the soccer ball is actually inside the header. It is called you know, a logo. So if I click on this Change Logo, and if I have an, a different picture, I can just click on this Browse and find the, uh, the, find the logo that I want to use, and, and it will uh, change right there. And uh, the soccer is actually right here, but it shows you, you know, a just a very small area, so you are, you are not seeing the ball. Uh, but trust me, uh, the ball is right here. And you can also choose to say, okay, no logo. Okay, if you don't have a logo or a picture that you want to put in there, you can just click on no logo, and then after that, click OK, and click on save changes again. And now this layout is saved. And when you return to the site, the soccer ball is gone. Okay, so again, you can put your own picture right there, and uh, you can change the, the layout or, or the theme, you know, of your uh, uh, of your uh, websites as frequently as you want. Uh, and these themes can make your uh, uh, websites look uh, more professionally. And um, one more thing, okay. When you go back to manage sites again, if you go to site layout, now you know you can click on edit, and if this is a navigation area, you can change the order of your, uh, the, your your menu items, right? But you notice some of them are say text, okay? Because when you add a sidebar at the item, you can choose between navigation. Or tags, or you know some other items, but um, uh, for tags, it is actually not just tags. Let me show you. If I created a, a text area like this, 
and then click on edit you you notice that uh, it is actually a um, kind of like a hyperlink text or enrich area and you can insert picture right here and you can make some you know fancy text uh, right there too so if there are some pictures that you want to show on the left hand side uh, where the navigation is you can you know create insert a a text uh, a bar a text bar a text sidebar item right here and then click on edit and go in and insert a picture um, and uh, in terms of changing further okay if you want to change the background image too so right now uh, this uh, this theme right here it has a certain background picture and if you want to change that too you can also change the back you know click on change background image right here and then find a background image and put it on top of what is already um, you know in the background and so it will cover uh, what it has uh, uh, in the original uh, theme. Okay?